Good morning, Facebookers, lookers, and lurkers. This is your girl, Jen, on this fabulous Friday here in hot Las Vegas. Today is July 14th, and I want to talk to you guys about what you're going to do. You know, um, it's really funny. We and at First, let me apologize for the tardiness this morning. I'm having technical technical difficulties getting online. So, But we're on now. Good morning, John. And um, so what I want to talk to you guys about is what you're going to do. And what are you talking about, Jennifer? What are you going to do? You know, oftentimes we pray and we ask God for more. Can you give me more on my job? Can you give me a bigger house? Can you give me a bigger car? And why this and why that? And I need more. I need more. I'm tired of dealing with these people, right? I'm tired of these people on my job. Lord, give me another job. Lord, I'm tired of driving this raggedy car. And ain't nothing wrong with your car. It's just old to you. Um, so Lord, give me, you know, bless me with more. How come they got it so good? Well, let's focus your attention to Jeremiah chapter 12. I encourage you to read the entire thing. You're talking about checking somebody tough this morning. He was all in my personal business. But anyway, um, let's focus on verse five, Jeremiah chapter 12, verse five. And so Lord speaking to Jeremiah and he says, hmm, so Jeremiah, so if you're worn out in this foot race with wind, with men what makes you think you can race against horses and if you can't keep your wits during times of calm what's going to happen when troubles break loose like a jordan in the flood now my question to you is this we're whining moaning complaining about what's going on right now if he gives us more isn't there more trouble isn't there more complications isn't there more to deal with we got to learn to be content with where we are not settle for where we are but you know what we need to be good stewards of where we are and what we have and instead of always saying, Lord, give me more, and how come how come he got it so good and he don't even do right? Well, don't worry about what they got going on. Nothing gets past God. Nobody gets away with anything. But we got enough business if we mind our own, okay? And again, you know, we want to compare. If we can't handle this right here, what you going to do with more? I'm just, I'm just asking. And, you know, it's, it's really funny because I look at, as I'm going through my studies, a lot of this stuff, I'm talking to me, you guys. So I'm not talking about you, you, you. I'm talking about Jen, Jen, Jen. And so you guys just keep that in your mind um, as you go through this day. You guys be blessed. Have a fabulous and safe weekend. Good morning, Chip, Billy, Ronell, Jerome, September, Big Sis Val, um, Medea, Mama, Poppy, Nelly. See you guys this morning. Um, thanks for tuning in. And I will chit chat with you on. Monday, okay? So what you gonna do now? That's my question. Have a good one. Bye-bye.